Hello and welcome to Gaming Weekly for the 2nd of November 2012 and to start off, Assassin's Creed 3 came out this week. I did not pick this game up on the release day but I will be picking it up later in this year and uh, if you're wondering what kind of score IGN gave it, it gave an 8.5 out of 10 which is pretty good but not as good as Halo 4's rating this week. Uh, they did a, re a review this week and they gave it a 9.8 out of 10 which is, I, I haven't seen a, uh, a score quite that high. I, I don't read many reviews but I haven't seen one that high and uh, they said it could be the best Halo so far so I'm super excited and uh, can't wait to pick it up next week. So the first piece of news this week isn't surprising to be perfectly honest. The voice actor of Captain Price uh, in the Modern Warfare series, uh, in the Call of Duty series, uh, went out and announced that uh, the next Call of Duty Infinity Ward will be making will be called Modern Warfare 4, which to be honest is no surprise. I wouldn't be surprised if they got to the year 2030 and were making Modern Warfare 10 or something like that. Uh, but I don't care really, but uh, uh, as long as it's not a uh, piece of crap that's rushed in six months, I'm perfectly fine with it. So uh, as long as you make a good game, keep keep on at it. So uh, our next piece of news this week is that GTA 5 is going to be released in spring of 2013. Can't wait to be able to play this game. Obviously, it isn't set in stone yet. It could be the end of spring or the very beginning of spring. Uh, it will be released. So. Um, We'll have to wait and see for that. So, if you pre order Black Ops 2, uh, you're obviously expecting the exclusive Nuketown 2025 map. Well, you can get a quick sneak peek by watching the trailer. And uh, the layout of the map hasn't changed at all, but the style of it has been updated to look futuristic, so that's pretty good. So I hope you enjoyed this episode for uh, November 2nd, 2012. If you did, make sure to check out the articles in the description below for more information on everything. So if you enjoyed this episode, please make sure to leave it a like. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll catch you all next time.